the phone. What time y'all three o'clock in the morning? Well, talking about, hey, how she can make it right. I'm sorry, y'all. I just got done listening. Y'all was playing my old school goodies playlist. And when I tell y'all, when that out green come on, that yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> but what's up, YouTube and all my baby baby? This is your girl with secrets coming at you with another video, y'all. And I'm a music head, so I thought I would just, you know, start off a little saucy. But in today's video, are uh, you know, I'm gonna do um a current favorites. And it's a current favorites of body products and stuff, stuff I use on my body, and it's just stuff that I'm in love with. And I wanted to share with y'all and everything is pretty affordable for the most part and I'll try to link everything below but I also will verbally mention where I purchase these items. I have them all in front of me so we gonna get into it. My first thing that I'm in love with y'all, Dr. Teal's, I'm in love with the brand but you know just got hip to the, what is this, the Cannabis Sativa Hemp Seed Oil with Essential Blend. When I tell y'all this, baby, I don't know if I'm late to the party again or what. Because usually when I go to Walmart, because I purchase this from Walmart, it's only like one or two. And I usually have to grab that one or two. And when I tell y'all, it smells so good. It just, it smells like you're just in the rainforest, in the middle of the rainforest, isolated by yourself, just showering. And it's just like... I don't know that's <laughs> it's hard to explain but it just it smells so good another thing and i want to say i purchased y'all wait i got some uh, i want to say i purchased this from marshall's and this was 4.99 and this is the neutrogena deep moisture body spray so this spray you can apply evenly quickly on wet skin so usually when i get out the shower I like to, you know, like towel dry to get all the water drops off. I like to spray this and you just, you know, put it in there and it gives you that moisture glistening once you like get freshly out the shower. Now you can still afterwards apply like your regular lotions, moisturizers and stuff like that, even though this is a deep moisture um, type of body mist, but you apply it as soon as you get out the shower. Now, if you want to be drenched and still apply it, you know results may vary but i just like to towel dry i still have moisture on my body but just to get the little droplets and stuff like that you know that's just me but that's this and i purchased this from marshall's once again 4.99 another thing since we're talking about neutrogena y'all this is a brand new one because i can't find one y'all i'll use some and it's probably under my bed because i'm not number 10 stuff falls under my bed so you know but this the hydro boost um what is this the overnight hydration cream with hydrochloric acid, minerals, and vitamin E is for normal to dry skin. Um, I'm not sure if I ever mentioned this earlier in any of my other videos, but I have very, 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 very bad eczema. Um, it's so bad that I have to get medicated ointment from my physician, but in combination of using my ointment, I like to keep my body moisturized. Um, a lot of the time my eczema is around my neck and it creases folds in my little chunky arms on my legs and stuff like that, um, on my back, you know, it's just everywhere. I have real bad eczema, mm, tomato, tomato. So I like to stay, you know, extra glistening, moisturizing. Sometimes I lotion up, well, majority of the time I lotion up when I go to bed. Sometimes I don't because I'm just being lazy, but I've been trying not to do that because you want to make sure you're keeping your body moisture because winter's ought to be here. And I know for me, when I don't moisturize during the other season, when winter comes, it hits me hard because my body, if I don't lotion real good and get all that moisturizing and nutrients in, my skin cracks. My skin cracks so bad that it will bleed. So you definitely want to make sure that you're moisturizing your skin because you want your skin to have that bounce back. If your skin doesn't bounce back, if it takes its time to get back to its normal state, that means you're A, either dehydrated or you need some moisture. So definitely invest in a good regimen, whether it's skincare, lotion, whatever. Just invest in good lotion. And I purchased this from Walmart. I want to say it's like eight or nine bucks. It's worth it. You get 16 ounces. That's pretty good. So we have those three. 
Now, another thing while we're talking about moisture, Tree Hut, they're great. Um, I use their, um, their body scrubs, but they also have different type of body butters. Me, I love things that are fruity, smells good, stuff like that. So recently I've been using their Kulata, their actual 24-hour um, intense hydrating shea butter, body butter. Y'all, when I tell y'all, smells good. Does the body good. And as you can see, I've been dipping it. And it smells good. It really smells like a pina colada. So if you like the, if you like pina coladas, <laughs> so if you like pina coladas, you know, coconutty, pineapple-y, if you like all of that, definitely a great buy. And I purchased this from Ulta. So usually Ulta has the pear, so it'll have the body butter, and then they'll also have the scrub. So if you can find the pears, it's great to match. If not, mix and match, you know, whatever you like to do. Since we're also talking about Tree Hut, I purchased this from Marshalls $3.99. This is the Tree Hut Bear. It's the post shave soothing mist, and it helps relieve itchy skin and prevents ingrown hairs. So, I still shave. I don't do the wax and all that extra stuff. I shave. I'm traditional. That's me. It works for me. So, it's good to. Hmm. To prevent ingrown hairs, discoloration, you also want to have a regimen when you shave. So when you shave your intimate areas, whether it's basically the triangle, 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 you know, nah, 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 yeah, you get my gist. You want to use the aftershave mist because basically it kind of caps whatever you shave and it stops irritation. So for me, this, it stops, uh, <laughs> it stops um, irritation. It doesn't burn because you know some after shave sprays it will burn I mean burn burn and another thing I learned when you're looking at ingredients whatever that first ingredient is usually that's what the product is mostly made of this is made of aqua made of majority of water so you know as long as the first ingredient is not alcohol you should be good this works for me it doesn't burn I spray it on the pocketbook my underarms you know my legs wherever you shave and it doesn't burn. It does have, um, what smell flavor is this? It doesn't say the actual flavor, but it has like pomegranate, orange, and grapefruit pictures. So that's the smell. So if you like that, that was the only, um, it smells good, but that was the only type of flavor it came in or scent it came in. They didn't have much of a variety. And you know, with Marshalls, if you see something, it's better best to just pick it up because if you go back, it's probably not going to be there. And this was $3.99. I purchased a few for me, a few for different family members. They don't have a problem with it. Me, I have extra sensitive skin, so I haven't had a problem with it breaking me out or anything like that. So this is definitely a great investment if you could find this at your Marshalls. Then a few more things. Um, I've always been a fan of Vaseline, especially like when I was a kid, y'all. Mama, I love you. And I know you wasn't the only mama that did this. But my, my mama would put Vaseline, you know, going as a kid, going to school, greased up, legs greased up, arms greased up, face greased up. Yes, we were moisturized, but baby, we look like little, little grease balls, just greased up. My mama used to always put Vaseline on my face, and I know I'm not the only one there, if you can understand. I know you understand. So Vaseline will always have my heart because it was part of the majority of my childhood, and it's still a part of my adulthood. And I just recently came across these because... I want to say I was looking for a good body shimmer and I was looking for the, you know, the name brands and stuff like that. When baby, when I tell y'all, they were high. Like when it comes to body products, I like to spend a good, you know, nice, you know, I'll spend money if I need to. If it's something Medicaid, I have to get like, you know, my ointment or stuff that's specifically for, you know, eczema and stuff like that. That's fine. I'm, I'll spend money for that because, you know, I have no choice. But other stuff, oh no, like I'm not about to spend a whole bunch of money for body shimmers. You know, I like the glistening, you know, you like that central pay vacation. You up there with the ditties and, you know, just doing the ditty bop and stuff. You want to have that nice glistening tan. You can get that for the fraction of the price, you know. So Vaseline recently came out with this Illuminate Me shimmering body oil, y'all. And when I tell you, it gives you that nice sun kiss like your skin is glistening and it's pretty and they also came out with the cocoa shimmer jelly stick and it also it smells so good hold on let me open this it it also has that glistening 
and you know it's just a stick you can keep you know like deodorant how you just keep on till it goes up so yeah and these when i tell y'all a good combination to have now it doesn't have like a whole bunch of glitter where you just look like some type of you know studio 51 like you just about to go jam and stuff it doesn't look like that so don't be afraid like oh i got all that glitter now it has a little glistening just a little glitter but it's nothing you should be concerned about and when i tell y'all a great investment a little pricey because i want to say each was like nine dollars but worth it and i purchased both of these from walmart and it just gives your body that sun kiss look without baking in the sun and then another thing I want to say, because who has this? Johnson's Baby. Which Johnson's and Johnson's Baby? They have their version, but sometimes even that can be a little pricey. So I got the Equate version, Walmart, Ain't No Shame My Game. Um, the Moisture Care Coco Divine Body Oil Gel. If you like the consistency of body oil, it's, I mean, body oil, um, baby oil, as far as how it moisturizes your skin, especially like in the summer, like I use it on my feet because I like my feet to be soft. So if you like that consistency without the extra oiliness, definitely invest in the gel. And they also, if you don't like cocoa, some people don't like the smell of cocoa or shea butter or whatever. They have um, the original kind, but this definitely gives you that consistency of a glistening baby oil without the extra chicken grease consistency feel. Like it doesn't like extra oily, you know, so extra oily that it's running down. So I like that. And I purchased that from Walmart. And then I want to say this is, it's called Gigi, if I'm not mistaken. G I don't know. G-I-G-I. -G -I. And this is the No Bump Roll-On. Now, I actually also use their shaving, um, it's like a shaving cream with like beads, exfoliating beads. Pretty good. But I actually use this. Now, you want to use this one or two days after you shave. Do not. I mean, do not. I repeat, do not use this as soon as after you shave because it's going to burn. Mind you, I just told y'all the first ingredient is usually what it's made out of. This is made out of alcohol. Wasn't paying attention. I used it before I read the, you know, the ingredients. Do not use this. Now, you can use this anywhere you shave. But don't use this exactly after you shave. Wait one or two days. Because it's going to burn like somebody then threw something on you and torched you up. I'm just saying. You've been warned. Because <laughs> I've done it before. And when I tell you I wanted to great balls of fire that's all i'm gonna say <laughs> and i bought that from ulta and another thing i purchased was some sterile saline wound wash now i purchased this and i purchased this from cbs is because as you can see your girls pierced up and you know my recent piercing for this one um i had to change the airing i had in it because it was too soon and you know me being hard-headed i thought i knew i was doing being grown and placed the wrong airing in there and I got me a little bump up <laughs> a little bump and usually when you get a bump on a piercing um there's a slight or highly chance that it's infected but not because of not you know it's not because being dirty or anything like that you can't place that under it basically it's because I put the wrong thing in there there's proper steps and procedures of when you have a piercing that you have to use the type of you know right piercing ring and stuff like that so I used the wrong nose ring I used the earring instead of a regular piercing ring they use for healing and I got me a bum bum and you know, I'm breaking out but um you can't really see because the bum has went down but if you have whether you still have old or new piercings it's good to have that type of wound wash because it helps with cleaning any type of debris and I had a few nights where my earring came out and instead of just you know disinfecting the earring I just popped it back there and went back to sleep and then woke up and handled the situation instead of handling the situation right then and there um, so that's another reason that your person can get infected but thanks to this little thing right here it has helped a lot and I always make sure I have some in stock and that's from CVS and then another thing I have is this Aveeno Calm and Restore for sensitive skin. It's oat gel moisturizer. And if you don't know, oat is great for the body, um, especially if you ever had chicken pox. I've had chicken pox as a kid. You know, you take an oat bath and stuff like that. Oat is also good for eczema. 
uh, when I'm having a very bad eczema flare. I get the little Aveeno oat packages, the little packets, put that in my bath water, soak in oat. So oat is great. And even when it comes to, um, as far as eating, you know, oatmeal, um, oats and, you know, oat milk, oat, whether you're ingesting it or just putting it on your body, is great for the body. So I have this for my skin. Um, right now, I recently had an MS flare. Um, if you're new to the channel, you know, if you're not new, you know, if you're new, then, um, I have multiple sclerosis, you know, I've been, yeah, so I've been dealing with that for, um, you know, quite some time now, and with MS, it affects everything, not just internally, but externally, so when I'm having a breakout because, you know, I've had to have a steroid treatment, I definitely use this, and it kind of, like, gives my skin a healing spot. You know feel so right now i'm going through the healing process i'm your girl currently on steroids so eh. but you know definitely this is good you know something good to invest in it is a little pricey it's close to like depending on where you get it from 15 to 20 dollars if you get it from cvs so you know but yeah i love that old stuff and last but not least baby Bum Bum Cream. <laughs> and this is by Sol Genario. Um, this is the original Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. This is their newer version, the Bright Cream, Bum Bum Cream. And this size, I want to say this size is like the $40 size. You know, it's $20 and $40. Y'all, I love Bum Bum Cream. And this lasts me for forever. I've been using this. And then, you know, I got the miniature one that I use, the pink kind. It smells so good, but nothing is as good as the original one. But if I had to pick, this would be first, second. Um, I haven't smelled the other ones because I want to say there's like a blue one. I might invest in that because I heard it has like a coconutty smell. But yeah, um, I purchased these from Ulta. You can only purchase these from Ulta. Um, I've seen them on Amazon, but you know, sometimes Amazon, they price, they products could be a little bit off. So it's better to just get it from the source. Um, but yes, y'all, if you know the Bum Bum Cream, it's no joke. Like you have some, you know, dupes of it, but there's nothing like the original one. So you can definitely purchase these from Ulta, y'all. And currently these are all my favorites of... The things I'm currently using, yes, I use these. These are not any type of paid sponsors, and I just wanted to share some good finds. So, I'll see you guys on the next video. Hopefully, y'all could come across these good ones too, and I'll try to link everything down below.